Hi, I'm William Tenholder, and I welcome you to my Masters 2000 series. You know, I've been playing games all around the world, and this is a fresh one. I've played thousands of games. This one is very exciting. I'm going to bring it to you at Magnus speed. I love the way he plays so fast. So here we go. Hold on to your hats. Put on your seatbelts. It's the ready opening. It's a Fianchetto on black side. It's a horse race. And we both get to a great position. We all have seen these positions before. The key moves of the game are coming up. And we're going to do this at Magnus speed. First, we open up the center. Next, we set up the rook. Next, we set up the trap. So the trap is coming. And... Here it is. There's the trap. We've got the pin. Now that we have the pin, we attack the queen and we win right here on the pin. The queen is under attack. Cannot take the knight. And now we take the rook. Beautiful attack. Basically, it's uh, move, what, 13? So move by move 12, the game is over, pretty much, right? However, they put up a good fight. You still have to finish the job. Now they attack the queen. Queen comes back. And now we have to do the hard work of winning the game. So, you know, we're doing our best. Go in there for check. They still have lots of pieces. And, uh, you know, that was a nice combo, right? Let's just take a quick look at that. The check... This is a combo. Check. Check. King has to move. Take the rook. Now, you might you might say most people would resign at this point, but uh, they were, you know, very resilient and they set up a trap for the queen. And this is a real trap. The queen cannot get out easily. Could be easily taken you just look where the queen is so let's go at speed here is the move of the game because if pawn takes bishop queen gets out of the trap we're still ahead however if knight takes queen bishop takes queen and we're still ahead so it's a beautiful solution to the trap queen moves to a position where it can put more pressure on this little trap. They want to trap my queen. They are really, really looking for this trap. Now, the queen is still not out of the trap, but good chances here. Notice the queen does not have many moves. So what do we do here? Check on the king. Yes, beautiful. So we'll continue at speed. Check on the king. We're sensing the game is pretty much over. However, there are a couple more tricks to be played. We want to exchange queens. So how do we get it, go about this? Well, okay, there's a sacrifice of the rook. And then check on the king. A beautiful attempt to exchange queens here so now the queen has to exchange or move queen moves to a good attacking position however check on the king we're sensing this should be pretty close to checkmate but the king has an escape on the a file so we have to close off that check king cannot escape okay now, we have discovered check. But also, we have what looks like could be a checkmate sequence. But, they have the bishop. So that's great. Now, we just trade off the bishops. Now, we seal off and continue to put pressure 
on the king position. And well, what we really want here, out of all of this, this sequence, we want this. That wins the game on the spot, right? So again, at Magnus speed, we forced the queen trade. That is it. Uh, they did not surrender. So let's look at Magnus speed, how this went. You can see that it was futile and they resigned at this point. Uh, you know, many players would have resigned before this. And some players would even play for a stalemate. So, congratulations on a well-played game. I'm William Tenholder. I love chess.